How's it everybody? I'm Stego 2 from the Bat Insane Army Crew. We are here today to present the new Super Scooter prototype called the Vito 115. This, uh, this development involved international countries. We, uh, we were given the name from Germany. We got all the onboard electronics from Japan. We got all the copy parts from China. And uh, the final uh, dynoing and jetting was done by one of the best in the country, Kurt Snashel from KH Performance. Right, we, um, we're now ready to open our challenge <coughs> to old Tourby, the beer man mechanic, Maynard. Tourby's been involved in uh, the, the scooter sport for less than uh, one week. And uh, he's opened this challenge to me that he will dice me at the Motor SA Superbike World Championship on the 27th of April, 2014. For you slow Okies, that's this year, not next year. When I was young and dumb at 40, I uh, did a 90-foot uh, freestyle jump and broke the South African, African and uh, international record. And I've actually been recruited by uh, let me show you, Nitro Circus, to uh, appear in their next show in Antarctica. Motorsport is inherently dangerous, uh, especially in scooter racing with the speeds we, uh, we attain on the track. So obviously the first overall most important part of the uh, protection is the leathers. This leather is designed in Italy, actually in Sicily, it is the Dianese uh, leathers that all the MotoGP guys uh, race with and is a very critical part of our protection. Then we have, underneath we have the Dianese chest protector. This is a very sexy part of our uh, uh, equipment and uh, this is supplied by Race in uh, Kyle Army who supply the top of the range products. I don't know if you've met Michaela from Race, yes. That's a, that's a bulky, eh? When, uh, when she fitted me out with that kit, I had a problem keeping my tough nuts from getting hot and excited. Then we move down to the, uh, to my most uh, famous idol in, uh, in, in uh, Scooter 1, or 202, sorry. And that is the essay editor of Superbike magazine. This Clinton Pinar, look at him in those Dianese leathers. Do I look quite the same as Clinton? I think I could be his twin brother. Lastly, uh, boots are very, very important. Uh, these are the City Alpine Star specialized scooter boots. As you can see from my pro riding, the wear and tear on them for my low speed cornering is unbelievable. I'm now going to run through the scooter with you because obviously these modifications are so advanced they've never been seen on a scooter in South Africa. Right, the most important thing in scooter circuit racing is to make sure you're going in the right direction on the track. So I don't know if you want to come forward and have a look at the latest in compass technology. For those a bit blind you do have a built-in magnifying glass to make sure you're going in the right direction. Right, secondly, we have the latest in transponder technology, if you'd like to uh, zoom in there a bit. The reason why we have adapted the latest uh, in transponders is because the ones rented out by Motor SA are so old that they add a five seconds delay to your time. Right, and then while you zoomed in here, we, you have dual purpose uh, race tires. Now the most amazing thing about these tires is that they are both slick and grooved, which means you can race on both dirt and wet track at the same time. Obviously, these tires make the TMPs look like they were developed by Nicky Lauda. Look, scooter racing is very stressful. and. Uh, 
obviously, as I said, racing a six minute race, hydration is very, very important. We don't uh, use those pup sucks, uh, like those uh, morphe bags that the uh, Enduro Queens use on their backs whilst uh, racing off them. We, we've designed and developed the latest in gas injection technology. You don't even have to suck like one of those Vespa Okies. You just hit the button and you get a mouthful like those Playboy chicks get at the Hefner Ranch every day. Alright, so this is obviously our drink pipe. I must make it very clear that this is a soda fountain scream soda. This is not NOS at all because a year ago NOS was banned from scooter racing because of a lot of complaints from the Scale Electrics company down in Alberton. Those All right, then we have the, uh, the amazing race, full system race pipe that uh, was developed in China. It is known as the PRV Dash Pink. This pipe makes pipes like Arrow, Arata, and Akrapovic look like basic industrial plumbing pipe. Now, I want to warn you, there is a company in South Africa called PRD, which stands for Pinkus Racing Developments, that have made a copy of this pipe. It is half the price but it certainly doesn't do what the PRV Pink does. At the rear of the Vito 115 Super Scoot, you will notice we have a 2,500 pound Nova winch. Right, this winch was specially developed, obviously because we are such honest and fair players uh, in the uh, scooter racing scene, that uh, we've specially developed this winch to tow any of those three bore, I mean 16 bore, uh, new rookie scooter riders because either their engines break down after every second lap or they happen to crash. A very important part of the Scooter 202 racing is uh, sponsors. It is, as you can see, a very, very uh, highly developed scooter which costs a lot of money. This scooter to develop cost us in the region of 1.2 million rand. We, uh, we're happy to uh, go over some of our sponsors with you. First we have the Flea Oil, which is the best diesel two-stroke oil in the world. We haven't had a problem with this oil, and uh, we believe that uh, it enhances the life of the engine. It adds at least six horsepower to the, uh, to the engine. So uh, we really want to thank the guys from, from Flea for their oil. We have seen that a lot of the top uh, pro riders are using Indy, uh, sorry, I mean cowboy oil. Um, but we have to point out that every rider besides ourselves uses this cowboy oil. And I think it is the only way that they are getting this oil into the market. Right. Secondly, uh, our second sponsor, very important sponsor, is Grange, who do corporate clothing and protective wear, gloves, boots, etc. The, uh, Mike the Scotsman has been very, very um, uh, helpful with us in providing these uh, items for our whole team. And uh, I will be racing with his product. Now these, if you can zoom in, are the Grange CE rated 007 anti-acid and oil gloves. Just don't use them in fuel because as you can see it does take the protective sheen off. But I must say it is a dual purpose glove because uh, if we do race in V-Town and those uh, little Italians get upset, it is also a rolling glove from Grange. All right, the corporate clothing range by Grange. This is their super sport race cap the uh, price of these is only 260 rand each. Look at the clarity of the embroidery work. Now, the lovely thing about this uh, embroidered cap is that if you want to, you simply remove the embroidery, 
and you can put the next one up. Mike, I think you're fantastic, buddy. Toby, I must tell you, I am very committed to winning the uh, Scooter Tour 2 Championship. Uh, I've been for psychological training at uh, Falkenberg. I have spent numerous hours on the track. To give you an indication of how long I've spent on the track, I've used a whole one and a half liters of petrol. As you can see, Stig O'Toole wins the Scooter Open Championship 2014. The podium ban at the back, as you can see, is only bad. And the reason for that is, why do we need any of the sponsors shown? Why do we need any of the riders shown? We are the winners. On the other side, the only two that we do cover is obviously Motorsport South Africa, which is very important, and the S Moto Auto Championship. As I said, seeing I will be taking first place on the podium, Bat Holdings has happy to donate the second and third place podium uh, places now. The question is, will Vespa beat PRD and take second on the podium, or will they end up third and PRD second? We don't know at this stage, but obviously, second place, there's going to be a lot of crime. There is a specialized dummy from KTM. We also have the bat, Potty, because obviously he's going to shit himself. Third place, I don't want to say the word because everybody is young. But please notice, third, you know what you are. Right, now we are going to show you the 16 ball. How to wheelie, how to get your knee down, and how to stand to pose. Five live. Tourby, as I said, I'll see you at the track. Enjoy our next episode, which will be on our new hybrid Phantom BZM GRC Mini Pocket Bike. Cheers, everybody. <laughs>